Oh, baby, we got some news for you today, ladies and gentlemen. Today, Dr. Disrespect has finally, finally made a direct response to the Twitch ban that wasn't just a one off comment or anything, it's an actual thing, and it's guilty. Kind of. That's kind of crazy. Anyways, Dr. Disrespect done tweets this today. The Twitch ban. Hello. I'd like to make a quick statement. Let's cut the fucking bullshit. As you know, there's no filter with me. I've always been upfront and real with you guys or anything that I can be upfront about. And I am always willing to accept responsibility, which is why I'm here now. First and foremost, I do want to apologize to everyone in my community, as well as those close to me, my team, and everyone at Midnight Society Game Studio. A lot of people have been left in the dark. But what happened yesterday with Midnight Society and I, and we made the painful decision collectively to have me step down. Our team is full of uh, incredibly talented and good people that have high career ambitions and families, and I'd never want to jeopardize the culture we have carefully crafted. Everyone has been wanting to know why I was banned from Twitch, but for reasons outside of my control, I was not allowed to say anything for the last several years. Now that two former Twitch employees have publicly disclosed the accusations, I can now tell you my side of the story regarding the ban. Were there Twitch whisper messages with an individual minor back in 2017? The answer is yes. Were there real intentions behind these messages? The answer is absolutely not. Uh, I'm going to be real, cutting off quick here. Every pedophile says that. These were casual, mutual conversations that sometimes lean too much in the direction of being inappropriate. Oh, but nothing more. Nothing illegal happened. No pictures were shared. No crimes were committed. I never even met the individual. I went through a lengthy arbitration regarding a civil dispute with Twitch, and that case was resolved by a settlement. Let me be clear. It was not a criminal case against me, and no criminal charges have ever been brought against me. Okay. Now, from a moral standpoint, I absolutely take responsibility. I should never, ever entertain these conversations to begin with. That's on me. That's on me as an adult, a husband, and a father. It should have never happened. I get it. I'm not perfect, and I'll fucking own my own sh This was stupid. Now, with all this said, don't get it fucking mistaken. I've seen all the remarks and labels being thrown around so loosely. Social media is a destruction zone. I'm no fucking predator or P PDF. Are you kidding me? Anyone that truly knows me fucking knows where I stand on those things with those types of people. That, that's a different level of disgust that I fucking hate even hearing about. Don't be labeling me as the worst of the worst with your exaggerations. Get the fuck out of here with that sh But I think I've said what I needed to say regarding the ban itself. That's it. That's why Twitch made the decision in 2020. To my team, community, industry, friends uh, that have supported me, I apologize. I wish I could have said all this sooner. You guys have always showed me and my family love and support throughout all these years. We love you guys uh, like you can't imagine. I have the fucking best community in circle. If any of this has made you uncomfortable, I get it. You don't have to support me anymore, but just know you have always been greatly appreciated. But trust me when I say this to all my haters that live and breathe social media with zero real life experience. I don't give a fuck about you. Finally, if you're uncomfortable with this entire statement, I think I'm a piece of shit. That's fine, but I'm not fucking going anywhere. I'm not the same guy that made this mistake all those years ago. I'm taking an extended vacation with my family as mentioned on stream. And I'm coming back with a heavy weight off my shoulders. They want me to disappear. Yeah, f***ing right. Wow. Tim the Tatman and Nick Merckx have also made their statements directly after this tweet going up. And at the end of this video now for you guys too. Wow. This is... Absolutely insane, bro. Everything I'm seeing. I have known Doc for a while now. We've played games for years. And um, seeing everything that is spiraling right now is a uh, very difficult thing for me personally. And I'm sure for a lot of y'all out there. I think for me... I know a lot of you are asking, Tim, what are you feeling? Tim, what are you feeling? My bottom line, I think, is if what he is saying where he said 
that he was messaging a minor and it would sometimes lead to teeter on inappropriate if he knew that was a minor and those were the messages being sent. I cannot support that. I can't. I appreciate y'all. I am, this is beat me up, but this is unfortunate to say the least. This is awful. So appreciate you guys. Thank you for the love you give. And uh, I'll see y'all soon, man. Yo, yo, checking in. I'm seeing everything on Twitter and uh, I read through Doc's tweet. And in that very tweet, uh, he basically confirms that, you know, he was texting an underage girl and it went weird sometimes, you know, and, and look, just to, just to be blunt and straightforward, man, uh, it, it, that's, that's inexcusable. It's unacceptable, right? Uh, there's no excuse for something like that. And, and I can't support it. Hang on, honey. Doing this, I'm talking to Twitter. I can't support it. I can't defend it. And, uh. Look, the boys and I are torn up over it too, man, because we played a lot of games with the guy and, and it feels a little weird, but what can you do, you know? So I just wanted to update you guys on, on my thoughts and how I'm feeling. And uh, I mean, look, I, ho I, hope, I hope you guys have a good day, all right? Wow, that's a lot to take in. I see, I don't know. See, I don't know. That's way too crazy. Dude, did, did he, there's too many questions to be asked. Did he know they were minors at the time? Why didn't Twitch say anything? Why were their hands tied? Somebody was threatening lawsuits here. We gotta get to the bottom of this. This statement has answered a small fraction of all our questions, but has now generated a million more questions on it. Let me know what you guys think. I got the Swarm came play for Call of Duty going up right now. You guys already know what it is. I love you. I'll be good because I'll you on the next one. Dr. Disrespect was caught talking to minors, and then he confirms it. Insane. I love you all. Please, 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 please don't talk to minors online.